Since uh, we've been on the road, which is nine years, um, this has always been my computer station and my everything. And we've decided in the last week or so, we actually sold an item that, that I've had for a long time that I never use. And we got a nice chunk of change and I said, well, let's get some stuff for the motorhome. Can't work outside, so we're going to work inside because it's supposed to rain again. So. I have my laptop and it always sits here on my lap and you know of course every time I want to get up I got to close it and I set it down over here and it's up and down and, and I break the wires I wear out the wires on the power unit and everything else. So I've been looking for a long long time and I was thinking to myself if I could just put this computer where it was right here all the time and um, I could just you know kind of work on it like that. It would be really awesome. So what we did is we bought a stand. So this is how I usually do it, but we bought a stand. So right here is normally, we've already popped this out. There's two of these cup holders. So we took, Darla got underneath there and took a, the bottom of the hammer and, and pounded it out. So now we got a, an open deal right here. This is part of the stand. So I've already put the screws in it. And we're gonna mount this like right here. What we need next here is we need this little gasket. I thought I was going to have to drill a hole and bolt it here. But what I, I'm seeing is, is that I don't have to do that, so I'm not going to do that. And some people may ask you, why are you not using that table that uh, swings up on that cabinet? I do use it, but the problem with that table is it's hard to get in and out of. And I actually moved you want to see this I took it and I dug I routed all this out and I moved this leg over so that it could get it out because the leg used to be right here in the middle it was just really really right in the middle of the table right in the middle of the table it was really uncomfortable to get in and out of and then I put this little latch on because when we travel when we're traveling down the road this thing has a constant uh, like a rattle sound Looks like it's gonna be closed but I think it's gonna work and then I'm going to run all the wires on the back side over there. So I actually was going to drill a hole in here and just put this bolt through, but... Uh, we never use that cup holder anyway. Yeah, that so. cup holder basically holds our glass uh, cleaning towels. So I'm going to have to lay down underneath here while Darla holds this up. I can't think of anything else that needs to go up there. And that's free. Alright, I need to slide out. Okay. There's the mounting pole. And then this piece right here. This is gonna slide down on it. Now these these things are not specifically designed for RVs. But I'll tell you what, man. That's pretty cool. That that worked out really good with that cup holder. Yeah, it did. I mean that's like right on the money. So you put this little, this slides in this little channel here. And I think that's the nut for that. Yeah, it kind of looks like it. Okay, so now that stays on there. The next thing that has to go on is this Gigantar thing. 
what's nice about that is there's holes in it so it will cool yeah that's on the underside and when you're not using it for your computer you can grill on it it's not a grill oh. So there's these little tapered screws. My daughter bought a set of screwdrivers the other day at, at Lowe's. And there's these cobalts. You get 12 screwdrivers for 15 bucks. And they're good screwdrivers. I like them. I think we're almost done here. Is this amazing? This is really simple. Mm -hmm. Especially with that pre-drilled hole. <laughs> yeah. Well, with the yeah, I, like I said, I was gonna. I was thinking I was gonna have to uh, put a nasty hole in my my table. And you know, one thing I gotta say, um, this may sound ridiculous to some people, but when you're living in these things full time, make it make it your own. You know, I mean, just make it your own. Yeah be surprised what you like there'll be people that'll come along and go, wow that was a really good idea i'm glad i don't have to do it you did it for me if you ever decide to sell you know well i especially like it because we did not have to drill a hole yeah I mean, we've never even driven a nail in this thing to hang a picture we use the 3m re right. removable stuff there it is look at that is where it was going to be how it was going to be, and, and that is like perfect the moon though. A little bit more up like that. So when I go to get up, I can just put it, push it out of my way. What's nice is, is that I mean, it's it's always right here now. And if you if I want it further away. You can do like this. See, that nice. might even be a little better to have it a little further away, so that when I get up and stuff, it's it's more out of the way. I like it. I like that a lot. That was forty-seven ninety-five, and I should have bought it when it was thirty-seven dollars. I saw it, but anyway, at the time, hey, look at new from Adventure Van Man. Yep. <laughs> yeah, this is great. And then I I found my little mouse, and I thought the uh, old cagey baby. Had, gotten rid of for me but uh, I, of course where I found it I don't think I put it. He's been really bad. He's in his cage right now because he's uh, he's too busy with uh, hiding stuff from us. So Anyway, so let us know what you think. I think that's a pretty cool deal right there, man. Looks like a really cool deal. And like I say, you can I can move it further away or I can make it closer. That was an easy install too. Real simple. Yeah, this pole kind of sticks up a little bit this side, but you may decide to chop that down too if you decide yeah. that you're you know that's a good possibility. I mean, not needing it the the dimensions of it. Anyway, thanks for watching. Uh, we'll have the link in the description below where we got this. If you want one. Hope you subscribe, hit the bell, and share. Oh, and thumbs up.